Greetings everybody, my name is Aaron Kucharski. Do you want to make money in the stock market like me? Well, let's get to it. This is Wizard Money. Woo! Do you want to make money in the stock market like me? Well, click the link below. Download the Robinhood app. You get a free stock. I get a free stock. We both get a free stock. And woo. Greetings, everybody, and welcome back to another episode of Wizard Money. So, on today's episode of Wizard Money, we're going to be talking about something very important. I want you to pay attention to this because I got some stock tips for you guys. I got my newest plays. I got my oldest plays. But some of these new plays you're going to want to listen up on. So... Hold on a second, guys. So today's episode, I wanted to focus on not just stocks specifically. But, but another thing that I hold near and dear to my heart, uh, excuse my handwriting, I want to talk about crypto. Cryptocurrency. This is the future. This is legitimately the future. This is the future. Everything is moving towards cryptocurrency. Everybody is jumping on the bandwagon for cryptocurrency. And if you and if, and if you want my picks, if you want my picks, I'll show you my picks. Massive, massive picks here, guys. Um, So uh, these these are the coins that I currently own, and these are all buys. These are all green green buys. Buy them now. Buy as many as you can get your hands on. I don't care what the price is. Just buy them all day. We have we have Bitcoin, we have Ethereum, and we have. Dogecoin, 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 whatever the hell you want to call it. Um, those are my three picks. Uh, let me check my portfolio right now. Um, so yeah, Ethereum is like my number one right now because obviously Bitcoin is so high you can't afford an entire coin. But I did buy, I bought an entire Ethereum coin around, I'm going to put the squares up again. I bought an entire Ethereum coin at 700 and change. And as of filming right now, as I'm staring at my phone right now, it's at 1,069. And it's actually 1,070. But, um, yeah. This is actually down because it went all the way up on the 4th to 1,165 or something like that. I've made so much money literally overnight on Ethereum. And I want to tell you why. I did a little bit of research on Ethereum and they are trying they're trying to roll out ethereum 2.0 there's like three different phases there's like zero phase zero 1.5 i think it was and like two but by the end of 2021 they are saying that ethereum could be two thousand dollars or more per coin now that's important because we just started the year 2021 and i'm going to hold this coin till till the end of the year because they're saying it's going to go up I mean yeah if you want to try and do like maneuvers during the year and sell it like when you think it's high and buy it back down low or whatever but it's going to slowly steadily increase I think it's going to hit that two thousand dollar price point so for ethereum I say buy anything anything under like if it dips under a thousand to nine hundred again buy you know because it's going to go back up um in 2018 I actually bought $100 worth of Ethereum because at the time I was trying to get to, to see a coin, um, but that ended up being a mistake play, which turned out to be the right play. I put $100 in Coinbase. Within a few weeks, my account had already tumbled, and next thing you know, it was only worth $10. But now my account is like back up to like $120 or something in, in Coinbase because I never sold it. I lost so much money on it. I'm like, you know what? I'm just going to leave it in there. If I lose it all, whatever, whatnot. 
Anyway, it skyrocketed, and now it's back up. Everything's up. Um, let me see what Bitcoin is at currently. Bitcoin is currently at... Alright, Bitcoin is at 30... 32,500. I currently have, I don't know if you can see this from there, but I got um, $6,831 invested right now overall. I'm up 100 bucks today because some of my other actual stock plays are, are, are panning out today. Washington Prime Group's up to $7. Um, if you haven't looked into that, look, check that one out. That one's kind of like an iffy bet because I lost a lot on them uh, because they were into like the mall scene and a lot of malls went downhill. Whatever, SM Energy's up $7. Uh, Ford is at eight sixty dollars a share. I sold pretty much my entire position of Ford at $9. It is slowly going down. Uh, if it goes back down to like $5 or $6 range, I'm going to buy them all back cheaper. Um, another new play that I was informed of um, by, by one of the guys in one of the group chats I'm in um, is CSLT, uh, Castlight Health. They are at $1.30 a share right now. Uh, I'm down 20 bucks because I didn't get in right when I was supposed to. I got in at $1.50. Um, I do have 100 shares of that. That is another new one that I bought into. Uh, and then the next one I'm about to talk about is Tesla. Tesla went into the S&P 500. I sold mine for about 6.30. I should not have sold my Tesla at 6.30. It is now 7.30. It's up $100 since I sold it, but I did make about a $200 profit, so I can't really complain too much about that. I'm kind of hoping it'll like work its way down to the six range, maybe buy back. I don't know, but this stock got kicked out of the S&P 500, and it even split off into two separate companies, um, AIV, Apartment Investment and Management. Um, I bought. 150 shares. I spent like 750 bucks on it. I'm down 50 because it did drop down even below to where I had it. But I'm hoping that that will at least go to $10 um, at some point in the future. I know apartments and, and and anything that has to do with real estate isn't doing so hot right now because coronavirus isn't letting up. When coronavirus lets up completely and we have this vaccine, which will happen a couple few months here, somewhere between April and August in that range. I think all these things are going to start going back up. Now, if you're wondering why I pulled out a lot of my stocks, um, I sold Six Flags, Carnival. I sold a lot of ones that I probably should have held on to a little bit longer because they did go up a little higher. Um, before April, April is when they're supposed, everything's supposed to start, you know, vaccine, whatever. I have a feeling that a lot of things are going to get locked back down. California's starting to get locked down, Canada, all that stuff. So there's, there might be another another country lockdown, maybe for a couple weeks or a month, whatever, depending on how high it skyrockets before the vaccine comes in. That being said, obviously everything's going to tank again. Um, I, I'm banking on a second crash. Some people say that's not going to happen. We've already priced that in. But I, I say we still have a chance to see another sizable downturn in the market before the vaccine's readily available, because right now we got the highest rates we've ever had you know more people are dying more people are getting the case you know the coronavirus case which by the way i do have my mask for those of you asking me if i wear it when i'm in the store i do i don't like wearing it on camera but if i have a customer come in you know anyway so yeah that's that's kind of where i'm at those are my new stocks everything else has pretty much stayed the same sold ford sold pennsylvania real estate because they they almost came back to an even for me so i sold out of them because they weren't going anywhere. They're like Washington Prime Group, but Washington Prime Group I didn't sell because they didn't get back enough to where I needed them to be. But they're climbing a little bit today. They're at seven dollars, so that's cool. Carnival I sold. I probably shouldn't have sold them, but I'll, I'll probably end up getting them back when they drop down a little bit again. Uh, Six Flags I bought at nineteen, sold at thirty-one, and I had a bunch of shares of those. I'm up like at least a couple grand of what I put in. Um, and I'm up another three to four hundred dollars from the Ethereum um, bet or whatever you want to call it. I mean, all stocks are technically bets, but uh, but yeah, Apple's up. I have I have four shares of Apple. Those are up 130 a share right now. Disney is up 178 dollars a share. I mean, this some stocks are up, some stocks are down. But but my big play right now is the Ethereum because. I did put I did put like 60 bucks into Bitcoin, but when a Bitcoin is $32,500, you're not really gonna uh, 
unless it goes to like 300,000. I mean, there are there are analysts that are saying it's gonna hit like hundreds of thousands of dollars. You know, I'm just gonna put like maybe 50 here and there in. I might have like a couple grand when it's all said and done invested in the Bitcoin. I'm not gonna be able to own a whole Bitcoin unless something crazy happens. But that's why I wanted to buy the Ethereum coin because I saw it was starting to go up. I'm like, nope, I bought it real fast. Um, seven and change. And now it's at 1067. It is climbing today. So that's a good sign. Now, you're all probably wondering about my third cryptocurrency bet, which was Dogecoin, Dogecoin. I prefer to call it Dogecoin because Dodge like the car. Um, anyway, the reason why I bought it is because it was once well, stupidly cheap. Like, one day I bought it and it was four tenths of a penny. Which means it would take three three Dodge coins to equal a penny. Um, and then the next day I look at my account because I put eleven dollars in and it had doubled to twenty two. And I'm thinking, oh my god, I had three thousand dollars worth of cash that I could have in Robinhood. I could have just dumped in and it would have doubled to six thousand. I'm like, I'm an idiot. I'm stupid, you know. So I ended up throwing another hundred dollars in when it was at zero point like six or seven. You know, it, it dropped down a little bit and I put in and then it went up to one and a half cents. So if you're looking for a, a long-term play, um, it's kind of like buying a penny stock. So there are going to be risks and gambles involved. It could drop back down. It could go back up. But seeing that it's so cheap, like it's literally, it, right now it's about a penny. It's at like nine tenths of a penny. So you could buy a crap ton of them. You could, you could get hundreds of these things for literally just a few dollars. I, I mean, I put I put a uh, hundred dollars in, hundred and some odd dollars in, and I got twelve thousand seven hundred twenty coins right now. And at the time of filming, um, they're at not point zero zero nine five one eight. I'm in at point zero zero seven one six. I am up thirty dollars. You know, and they're not even at a penny. So this is something that if it goes to even a nickel or a dime, you know, you're you're going to be banking crap tons of money. And I know a lot of people are saying, oh, you're crazy. It's never going to go to a nickel. It's never going to go to a dime. That thing's been dead. All cryptocurrencies are going to start to see lots of gains this year. This is a big year for crypto. Um, Ethereum's rolling out 2.0. Ethereum's going to go up. I, I say anything under 1,000, just buy Ethereum, you know. Um, let me see. What else have we got here? The ones I don't recommend... I mean, everything's gonna go up, so I guess you can't really, you can't really t have like a bad pick when it comes to cryptocurrencies. But like, for for instance, uh, Bitcoin Cash or or Litecoin Classic or all those, like Litecoin, like Ether, 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 Ethereum Classic is seven dollars and eight cents right now. Litecoin is at one fifty five. Um, all the cryptos pretty much do the same things around the same time. So, if you notice, there's a pattern. Like it, it, I'll, I'll, I'll put a thing up on the screen, but all of them are essentially doing the same thing. So whatever, whatever, whatever Bitcoin is doing, all the other ones will typically follow suit. So, but I wouldn't recommend Bitcoin Cash, um, or, 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 for the, or for that matter, Ethereum Classic. Just go, go, with, go with the big boys. So I'm going to put in the sell category um, Ethereum what did I say Ethereum Classic sell that sell bit coin cash sell both of those if you have them Put all of that money into Bitcoin or Ethereum stock board with the plays. That's what you do. Um, because crypto, crypto is the future, guys. Crypto is literally the future, guys. I just wanted, wanted to update you guys on that. I know this has been a very long video. Sorry for that. But, yeah, cryptocurrency, buy Bitcoin, buy Ethereum. Download Robinhood. Subscribe to Robinhood. Subscribe to Video Game Wizard, the channel. You get a stock. I get a stock. You know, 
I don't know what more to say. Crypto, baby! <laughs>